Hello everyone, I'm Sohrab from iGrimstuff and today I want to show you a new tool with the name TSEN Polygon. This is a tool to draw TSEN polygons and calculate the area of each stations or area of uh, or uh, calculate the average value of each stations based on the area uh, and uh, Voronoi algorithm. Um, you should uh, enter or input two information borders, border of the region and also list of stations. You can enter the list of station name, latitude and longitude manually here. And also you can input it by using the file. This is the sample file that we, I will load it in the um, website. You can find the link in description of the video. Uh, this three item is mandatory. It has a star and you should input it. But about this three item, this is optional. This is the latitude and long longitude of the text on the map or image. And also this is the value of uh, your variable. Here is the rainfall value. And now I want to use these three items. Okay. This is the list of stations. About the borders, you have three options to uh, select the borders. First, you can select the corner of the border, rectangular border, left button and right top, latitude and longitude of this two point. And another option is uh, find the rectangular region based on the minimum and maximum of latitude and longitude plus and mi minus a, a value, a dx value. You can change the dx value to any value that you want. But now I want to draw it with corner. This is the corner. It has near to minimum stations. It's not good. Another option is use a DX based on the stations. This is the minimum longitude. Okay, you can use the polygon by fill the polygon using the file or enter manually. Now I want to use the file. It's easily just latitude and longitude of the points of the border polygon you can draw it and uh, the region with limit to the polygon you have uh, several checkbox to show the name of stations here and display the area display the area in degree on uh, square kilometers or square degree degree or any unit that the latitude and longitude x and y and y and x have when i draw it the station one for example is here if you want to have it with a square kilometer it is here there is some option that you can change it here the font family of text, the uh, font size, font color, and line color. Now I want to show you and select a, just for sample a color and line thickness and also markers. And this is the decimal value, this decimal value of the text area or area in square kilometers, I change it to zero and I have it as an integer value. And also you can, you have, uh, you have an, another tab to show the polygon on map. This is the polygon, you can zoom in and zoom out and also with uh, mouse you can zoom it and zoom out uh, 
the important things is uh, you can change the tile of map you don't have any option to change the map just you can change the tile of the map with any items the third uh, tab is the area list of area based on the stations you can export them to excel this is the excel file that i exported okay and uh, this is not active because you didn't input any uh, uh, value for each stations here the value is empty and also this uh, checkbox is inactive because you didn't enter the latitude of the text another option for sample data is using this button okay when i change it the location of the station one is change check the location is changed if you want to change the location of a station one you can change any uh, latitude is here uh, just for sample i will change it the latitude okay to value this value it, the, lo the location is changed the position of the text is changed i want to change it to more value <coughs> the position of a station one is changing okay mm, another item in third tab is uh, calculate the area i have the value so i can uh, calculate it based on the, this formula this formula i can calculate the average area mm. <clears throat> another item is uh, you can export you can save the image to the file this is the original wise and haze of the image you can change it to any value and also you can change the dpi the resolution of the the resolution of the image i want to find the name for it i should delete the previous one okay test.jpg i want to save okay now i want to show you the file file is here okay this is the file to image okay thank you for watching this video please like the video and subscribe the channel to get more video about the tools bye